La 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 do do do. Curly is in the park. Magic in the city. Over the rainbow at the end of the street is Jubilee Park where the fairies meet. Away from traffic in the neon scene, doing the magic, keeping it green. Fairies, elves, goblins too. You can't see us, but we see you. So watch your step with your person feet. Over the rainbow at the end of the street. Rehearsal, crystal ball installation. Hmm, they're on my list for tomorrow. Oh, perk up the daisies. There, done. Crikey, organizing the Fairyland Flatter is hard work. But it's my favorite event of the year. Dancing, gorgeous butterflies, beautiful gowns. Uh, uh, I'm not sure gown is quite my style. Oh, you must dress up. Everyone does for the Fairyland Flutter. Yeah, dude, you gotta look totally bodacious. <clears throat> so, Pearly, everything in order? It'd better be. The dance competition is being beamed live around Fairyland via crystal ball. Every little flaw and imperfection will be on display. <laughs> Ludwig! Apologies. I won't let the sun's rays taint your skin again. Don't worry, Sapphira. I've organized the very best lighting from... Oh, there he is now! Yoo-hoo! Blair! Hey, Pearly. Ew. I was just telling my cousin Sapphira about your brilliant lights. How's it all going? Don't you worry, Pearly. By tomorrow, this place will be fully amped. I got a full rig. Spots, strobes, disco effects. The whole of Fairyland will be able to tune in and watch you bust some moves. Wow! You're good, Blair. So, we'll see you there? What? Don't encourage him, Pearly. Everyone knows the only place for a Bogart is backstage. Sapphira, that's so rude. It's okay. I'm a behind-the-scenes Bogart. Anyway, I better get back to it. See you later. See, Pearly? It's better if everyone just does what they do best. And I think you'll find I'll be the best dancer of the night. <sighs> Come on, let's see if you can find me a frock. Catch you later, Jasper. Bye, dudes. Mm. These rose petal muffins are delicious, aren't they? I just can't make important decisions about fashion on an empty stomach. Mm -mm. I think this would look fantastic on you. Wow! It's beautiful! Uh, is it me? <gasps> Stars and moonbeams, it's utterly you. We'll be the bells of the ball. Wakey, wakey, Opal. We slept in. <sighs> wow. I can't believe we ate the lot. Not to worry. A few muffins never hurt anyone. Actually, Pearly. Now, let's get moving. My dance partner, Finn, is popping by to see the venue. Uh, then I really think you better take a look. Gotta run. In the mirror. Everything is perfect. Nothing could possibly go wrong. Um, yeah. Listen, Pearly. I've got bad news. Bad news? Oh, don't be silly, Opal. Today's a good news day. Right, Jasper? Whoa! Killer carbuncle you got there, Pearly. Sorry? I was trying to tell you. <gasps> oh, no! A pimple! It's giant! Now, Pearly, don't panic. Nobody will even notice. You know, much. I had a throbber like that once. I just took it as a sign that I just needed to chill out. I don't have time to chill, Jasper. I've got to get rid of this thing. Sapphira, maybe she can help. Ah, Ugh, Pearly! Oh, we're so very busy here. Why don't you pick me up from my shell around dusk? Well, uh, that's why I drop by, you see. Uh, due to unforeseen carbuncles, I mean circumpimples, <gasps> circumstances! Ha! <laughs> I have to uh, cancel our appointment tonight. I have to... Floss. Yeah, okay, bye. Oh, what a creep. Man, that is one totally phony tooth fairy. 
Now I've got no one to dance with, all because of this pimple. I have to go and see Sapphira. Cousin Sapphira, you have to help! No problem. As it happens, I've got just the thing. Find the small brown bottle locked in the storage room. Take the leech slime label off and bring it to me. <laughs> Certainly, mistress. <laughs> Thanks a zillion. I so want everything to be perfect tonight. Dearest, by the time I'm finished, nobody will be able to tear their eyes from you. One bottle of leech slime, uh, I mean, peach sublime. <laughs> Cover your skin with a generous amount, followed by a layer of lavender. Then leave it to work its magic. Oh, how can I ever thank you? The look on your face tonight will be thanks enough, cousin dear. Come on in. I'm just about to remove Sapphira's face mask. Here, let me help you. What is this stuff? Peach sublime. Well, is it gone? Uh, not exactly. <laughs> ah! Get rid of that stuff! <laughs> Ooh, it, huh. <laughs> Yummy! <laughs> so, what happened? She must have had some kind of reaction to the tincture. But blemishes do add character. I'm sure it will subside in a few days. A few days? What am I going to do about the flutter? There's only one thing you can do. Stay home. Oh. You can't expect viewers from all over Fairyland to put up with such ugliness. I thought the Fairyland flutter was all about dancing, not what you look like. That's right, Opal. And I don't have a dance partner. I guess I should just stay home. You go and get ready. I'll check out the venue one last time. <laughs> Looking good. Hey, Pearly. I know how you like everything to be perfect. And everything is perfect. So, you all ready for the dance tonight? Actually, I'm not going. What? You? The best dancer in the whole place? Why not? Isn't it obvious? My face. Lovely face, cute nose, great smile, pearlescent teeth. What am I missing? <laughs> you should be out there busting a groove tonight. Whoa! <gasps> You're the one who should be out there. Yeah? Well, who'd want to dance with me? I would. I'd love to be your dance partner. Really? Yes. Let's you and I strut our stuff. Excuse me, Pearly. Big smile. Ah, thanks, Pearly. Who's your dancing partner? I'd like to introduce you to Blair, the best dancer in the whole of Fairyland. And he did all the lights. Pearly, I'm so glad you came. Wow, you two? On a date? Hey, wait up. See, Opal asked me because... No, I didn't. Uh, you asked me. Oh, trouble in paradise. Now that sells magazines. Here we go. You should have told me. We could have double dated. It's so, so not, not a date. date. <laughs> <laughs> Yuck. Can't it even taste pink. Mr. Flea, my friend, you only had to ask. Behold, my tasty condimento. Ooh, yummo! <laughs> Your enamel looks milky white under this lighting. Don't talk. Pearly, what are you doing here? And with him? Finn, I thought you had to floss. <laughs> Excuse us, won't you? <gasps> you look simply smashing, Sapphira. Thank you, Gobsmack. You, on the other hand, should know that the Fairyland Flutter requires certain, <clears throat> shall we say, standards of grooming. We're broadcasting on crystal balls here, people. Excuse me? Our talent as dancers is all that should matter. Uh, come on, Pearly. <clears throat> I've got work to do anyways. Backstage. It's nice and dark there. Hey, no worries. Well, you didn't really think you'd get in with me as your date, did you? Why else would I have asked you? 
You can outdance anybody, Blair. I told you, it's all about the dancing. For beautiful fairies like you, maybe. But for me, everyone's too busy looking at how ugly I am to notice how I dance. That's not true, Blair. And I'm going to prove it to you. Woo! Come on. <laughs> isn't part of the dance floor, and besides, they're ugly! And the couple who have received the highest number of fairy votes this year, and who are declared to be the very best dancers at this year's Fairyland Flutter. I've been waiting for this moment for my entire life. And who are... Ah, Pearly and Blair? What? Woohoo! <laughs> that was amazing, you two. Oh, congratulations! Oh my! You made a little hairs on the back of my neck stand at attention. Look, you can still see them. Oh, it's well, of course. They were but amateurs compared to you, <laughs> most precious jewel of darkness. And as for you, Finn, if you put as much effort into your dancing as you do into your dental hygiene, we would have won. <laughs> ah! <laughs> what? Don't worry, Sapphira. It'll go away in a few days. And remember, blemishes add character. No! Fresh after a shower. Hmm, but that rainbow could use a little... Beauty! I think our work is done for today. Let's have a little cup of... <gasps> Hurly Burly! Whoa. Uh, looks like we're not finished yet. Fort <laughs> means left, you numbskull. <laughs> you Cousin! Looks like quite a disaster you have here. How could you allow this to happen? I don't know, sir. We were just... <laughs> Sorry, dudes. Eek! We're sinking! I can't swim! Do you hear me? I'm going under! Try standing up. <laughs> uh, uh, mistress. If this swamp isn't drained forthwith, persons will be sure to shut down Jubilee Park. And that, may I remind you, has never ever happened. Hey, isn't that a person's job? They're the ones who are supposed to look after the rainwater and the drains and stuff. But it's my responsibility if the problem was caused by someone else in the park. Mr. Flea, let's get this lot back to the drain. More treasures for our cozy home, Miss Pearly. <laughs> we, we got an underground palace going on. The rats. Look at all that water, Mr. Flea. <laughs> Oh, I'm on the Riviera. Scrag, Mr. Flea, you've got to move your junk. We prefer to call them collectibles. It doesn't matter what you call it. You've blocked the drain and you have to clear it right now. No, it's our home and we can do what we like with our stuff. Yeah, we don't go around telling you where to keep your frillies and frou-frous. <laughs> Either haul that junk out of here or I'm going to kick you out of the park for good. <laughs> you always say that, but you too nice to do it. Yeah, yeah too nice. <laughs> <sighs> Your authority in the park seems to be in question here, Pearly. Mm. You two, you're out! How long till all this blows over? Blows over? You flooded the park! So, a couple of hours? No! I've tried with you two. I really have. This is serious. You'll have to find somewhere else to live. I'm sorry, but that's it. Uh, I think she meant it, Scrag. But, but our, our home's in there. That's rough, buddy. She's great. 
Hey, could we come live with you guys? Sure. Lots of room for you. Uh. Yoo-hoo! Vermin, you've got as much right to live in the park as anyone else. That's sweet of you to say, but we can't come back with Pearly so steamed at us. Yeah, I don't want to get zapped again. I, I got a delicate derriere. It's such a shame for all those donuts to go to waste. Donuts? donuts? Dozens of them. In the dumpster behind the kiosk. Hey, but our drain's flooded. We can't go back in there. So build a new dream home. They say a rat's home is his castle. We'll build a castle. We'll have our own kingdom. Come on! Donuts for all my friends! Hey! Donuts for everyone! A flood followed by a cockroach infestation. There's no way persons will leave the park open. Oh, sublimely devious, my beautiful mistress. And cockroaches are so country, huh? I can't eat just one. No. Once persons have closed down the park, you can have all the crunchy cockroaches you want, my little bat fiend. Oh, I can't wait! <laughs> starting to drop. <laughs> Excellent work, everybody. By morning, this will all be drained away and the park will be green and perfect again. Yes! Yeah! <laughs> 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 Oi, something reeks around here. <gasps> Crikey. What's the emergency? I hope this is important, dude. <gasps> Whoa. Oh, no. The rats are back. Roots and twigs! What a disgusting junk heap! I proclaim this to be the new kingdom of Ratopia! And I'm the king! <laughs> well, how come you get to be king? The smartest, best-looking one always gets to be king. This is our castle, and if we want to make a right royal mess, we will. Scrag, Mr. Flea, you can't do this. We'll all be in big trouble. Whoa, hold it. The boss says you can't come in. Yeah, back off, sister. <gasps> we need a plan. Back to my place. <laughs> Scrag! What got into your tiny rat brain? When I told you to build your dream home, I didn't mean so close to my spa. But this is prime real estate here. Yeah. <laughs> my spa is an upmarket luxury resort. I can see this slum from my new hot tub. So move it, now! No way! And we ain't moving for no fancy fairy pants. What? <laughs> <laughs> We've got to get rid of them, Ludwig. And to do that, I've got to do the most awful, unpleasant thing I've ever had to do. Oh, mistress! What is this terrible thing, huh? I've got to... <sighs> Help! Pearly! I could throw them out again, but they'd just come back. Yoo-hoo! That vile heap of whatever it is has got to go, and the way I see it, We've got two options. Sapphira? You've come to help? What are the two options? Rat poison or dynamite. <gasps> poison? Goodness, no! Dynamite it is, then. Surely not. Hmm. There's one thing I could try. Ah, uh, our glorious kingdom of Ratopia. I like it here. It, the fresh, fragranty smell of trash. Ah, uh, this is living. Eddie, foot rub. What? Foot rub? What do you think this is? I'm the king here, so foot rub. Well, foot rubs ain't in my job description. Whoa! Whoa. Ah. Stink bomb! Ah. It's floral. Could be fatal. I, I, I can't breathe. One, two, three! One, two, three! One, two, three! Alley-oop! Drat. 
Nice try. So, time for the dynamite, then? No! That'll teach him. <laughs> How's about a little snack, Mr. Flea? Yeah, donuts. <laughs> yeah! The donuts? Gone! All gone! That was all the food that we had. It should have lasted us for weeks. No more food? We're out of here. Hey, check it out! The cockroaches are ditching! My crispy country lunch is leaving! <laughs> cockroaches only leave when there's no more food, which gives me an idea. I'm so hungry! I feel faint! Do I look thinner to you? You can put these scrumptious sandwiches at the end of the table. Mm, and where do I put this sublimely odorific cheese plate? Next to the bowl of luscious strawberries? Oh, yes, please. And what have you brought for our feast, Sapphira? A can of beans. <sighs> <sighs> Yummy. Well, I think we've got too much food here. I know I can't eat it all. What shall we do with all this food? Mm. Did you see all that grub? It's a trick, Chumpster. Be strong. Even the little people, like you, have to make sacrifices for the kingdom of Ratopia. He is the cake! A six-layer chocolate marshmallow meringue cheesecake masterpiece topped with curdled ice cream, moldy gumdrops, and stale sprinkles. So long, Ratopia. Bye! <laughs> <laughs> Oh. Here's the deal. You can return to your old home in the drain on two conditions. One, you clean up this mess. And two, you'll allow Jasper to do a little home renovation for you. I'm going to build a kind of cage thing out to keep all your uh, collectibles from getting stuck in the drain again. Wait. Ah, uh, that sounds fair to us, uh, Miss Pearly. <laughs> yeah, but we got one condition, too. Gentlemen. You have a deal. Dig in. <laughs> oh, more empathy, fellas. I can't believe you're letting those filthy rodents stay. Oh, they won't be filthy after tomorrow. What do they want? Uh, we're here for our all-day hot tub soak. Our fleas have really been looking forward to it. <laughs> 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 oh, oh. 